The Petersons used everything in their arsenal. We tried a bunch of different traps from a variety of stores, all the different sizes, brands, didn't seem to make much of a difference. But the cockroaches made the Atlanta condo their home too. They always sort of came back and didn't seem to react to the traps at all. The Petersons aren't alone in their frustration. The persistent cockroach problem stumped scientists as well, until now. In this case, the cockroaches outfoxed us by, by developing an aversion to a nutrient. That nutrient is the sugar glucose in corn syrup, which had been commonly mixed with poison. Researchers at North Carolina State University discovered how the critters had mysteriously lost their sweet tooth. This is just peanut butter and this is jelly. This contains glucose. Watch as most of the roaches turn up their noses at the jelly but swarm around the peanut butter. The, the importance of this study is twofold. From a, from a practical perspective, it tells us that we need to modify the baits that we use to control cockroaches and to vary the nutrient composition of the bait. A change that will help homeowners in the cockroach wars. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.